All right, y'all. Uh, you know who I am. Of course, I'm John Doe. And I really hope I know you too, man. All right, so finally have a chance to sit down a little bit. I've been um, at a festival down in Hamamatsu City the past couple of days. It's Golden Week in Japan. Enjoying all that madness. And currently, I finally have, you know, a day here in Tokyo. So we can sit down and do one of these vids. Actually, tomorrow, tomorrow morning, I start a journey that's very rare. Something I haven't done in over six years. I'll be going to America. That's right. Oh, the land of capital is glory. You know. But I haven't been there in over six years. I'm see some friends and family. Raise a bit of hell, good old fashioned uh, West Virginia style. So, anyways, we are drinking with a Marxist. So, today, actually drinking a halfway decent beer. It was a little leftover from the recent festivities in Hamamatsu. And when I left, my bag was filled with alcohol. So, as you know, little gifts, you know, because what are they going to do with it? You know, they're going to, you know. So, here's what we got Kitten. Kieran. Some Kieran. Let's crack his bad boy open. Ugh. Salute. To the comrades. Oh, all right. So, the thing I kind of want to talk about in this vid is something that often frustrates me. But right now I'm calm enough and can talk about this. Is stubbornness. That I see going through um, red left circles, you know, red leftist. Um, I'm going to include so communist and Marxist and socialist in, in this. Because it's overall a stubbornness that I notice. This whole thing where it's like, if you're not red, fuck you, I'm not going to listen to you or cooperate with you or work with you at all. Now... That kind of attitude is extremely counterproductive. Because I don't know how many of you actually get out here in the real world and get involved in things involving labor, or activist things, uh, protesting, being very aware and active and getting involved in things in general but what you should realize is that the way you think things operate don't all right you can't just go into an organization or a group or a movement or anything going on and say I'm a communist I'm a Marxist I'm here I'm an anarchist I'm here to save the day <laughs> Join me, yes, brothers and sisters. Revolution, ha ha. Uh uh. It don't work like that. It really, really doesn't work like that. And if you jump into something acting like that, people are going to be really pissed off at you, annoyed by you, and in general, just you know, they're just like fuck you. Who do you think you are? Come in here like this. If you don't know anybody, you ain't pulled any time in this. You know, we don't know you, we don't trust you, fuck off. Crazy radical. That's going to be the reaction you get. Know that. So, but there's another way to go about things and get involved in stuff. And trying to shift things over to more of a red leftist viewpoint. More of the red leftist agenda. you got to work with people. Regardless of their worldview or political mindset. you got to learn how to work with people. 
You got to learn how to communicate with people. You, you're not going to agree on everything. That's not going to happen. Especially when you go into more like a center left group. Who's got something going on. They got a good idea. Or you're dealing with more liberals. And especially when you're dealing with like more conservative minded people. And we know all these things are like political identity. But to them... They only understand the, the metaphysical, social constructs of things. So th for them, it's very real. And you have to learn how to work with these people. When they are right, they are right. And when they are right, and when they really get it, and they, boom, get it. Yes, support them. Work with them. They will start to like you, Okay. And if pe when people like each other, that's a big thing if you didn't know that. A really big thing. So you get involved in something they're doing. And they see, and you be very open. I'm a Marxist, I'm a communist. But you work with them, you know. You help them achieve this goal or this idea, that this thing they're trying to do. And you know it's right and good thing, you know. And they will remember you. And they will appreciate you. And then, something very interesting happens. They start to trust you. And they start to listen to you. And then, that's the point. You can be a bit more vocal. You can be a bit more brave and bold with your words. When you're speaking. It takes time. All right. So guys, ladies, all genders, whatever, learn to work with people. Stop going at it with people so much. Calm the fuck down. Yo, man, like, cooperate. For example, Liberals have many positions, you know. And some of them good and on point and right, but others just just totally reactionary and off base and you know just stupid. You know? But liberals are more susceptible to leftist thinking, to the red left. So when they're right, get involved. Things like sexual harassment. Uh, things like racism, things like um, unions, labor unions. Oh yeah, yes, yes. The red left needs to take that back. It was taken from us, you know, that weapon. You know, get involved in these things. Play the game. Learn the internal politics of the situation you're involved in. And support people. Stand by people, and they remember you. You know, oh John Doe's crazy as hell. But he stood by us when we needed him. He ain't so bad. And then people start to trust. And they start to listen. They go, ah. Crazy white boy's got a fucking point. We might want to listen more. So that's my general point. You know, you can do that for any group. Not just little boys. You can do it with conservatives. You can do it with, you know, any group. Really. The far right. Even the fucking far right. If you find the right group of far rights, you can find things that they will understand. And you'll have some of their members coming over to our side and start to understand things. You see how that works? So that's just what I want to say, you know, guys, um, ladies, everyone. Learn to work with people. Once you get here in the real world, you'll learn. You'll see. You know, so... Until next time, as always, you been drinking. Ah, with a Marxist. <laughs>